Bank Country Director Pierre Frank Laporte is reported to have said that the Mahama administration signed the most expensive agreements in the energy sector. According to him, Ghana is paying more for power than it should be, even for electricity not used due to the terms of the power purchase agreements. But former power minister under the Eswal Mahama administration, Dr. Kwabena Donko, says the country's director's comments are inaccurate and partisan. He claimed we signed the most expensive PPAs, we also signed take or pay agreements, and we signed PPAs that we couldn't recover the price. Ameri is the cheapest thermal plant agreement signed in the country. The Jacobson power purchase agreement is cheaper than some of the existing power purchase agreements such as the Sonora Sogle power plant one. So that couldn't be factual. He said Pierre Frank Laporte should have focused on the deteriorating exchange rate which has affected power purchase agreements. The exchange rate has so deteriorated between first January 2017 and as at yesterday, the exchange rate had almost tripled the CD to the dollar. And when you have that kind of situation, you are going to have a situation where the domestic tariff will not keep up with the external tariff. And I was expecting the World Bank country director to rather address the inefficiencies in the economy leading to currency instability, which impacts our tariffs. But when a country director picks one regime and inaccurately attributes all the challenges of the sector to that regime, he's being partisan and he's not helping build the consensus, build the agreement we need to move forward in the power sector. He denied the claims that the agreements signed were the most expensive. After the Mahama administration left power, the current administration has signed at least three agreements. The Tema LNG, which has a take or pay element, the AXA new power purchase agreement, which has a take or pay element and the interim AXA agreement has take or pay. And so the question of take or pay being the monopoly of one particular political party does not arise. He asked the country director to provide solutions to address the current energy sector issues rather than engage in partisan and divisive comments.